Cars are very important in our modern society. Either luxury or economy, we buy them to fulfill our daily and adventurous needs. Almost every car bought and used by Africans are imported. Most of these cars are used, which comes a very high import duty fees. The African automobile industry is responding to this by manufacturing durable, and affordable cars. The likes of Ghana Kantanka and Nigeria's Innocent Motors are changing the African automobile story. Here are seven African-owned automobile companies, changing the continent's automobile narrative. The number seven on the list is Wally's car. Passionate about niche vehicles since their childhood, two brothers, Zed brothers, were inspired by their meeting and decided to take the plunge, the creation of a new car brand, the Wally's car. The idea was born in 2005 during a fortuitous meeting on the island of Wallace, and Futuna between the Guiga brothers, and the former Jeep Dallas car manufacturer, Mr. Rene Bosch. Only three years later, the Wally's Isis was presented at the 2008 Paris Motor Show. Equipped with a completely fiberglass body, a galvanized chassis and a PSA powertrain engine, the model was homologated in Europe. And went into production in 2009. He is very successful at the international level. Since its inception, Wally's has produced more than 2,200 cars, with PSA powertrain engines. This is the result of a relationship of mutual trust and shared values that allow them to design and produce Wally's vehicles with the most reliable, economical and compact engines on the market. Six, Mobius Motors. Located in Kenya, Mobius was founded in 2011 by Joel Jackson to build a vehicle in Africa, for Africa. The first generation Mobius 2 was launched in Kenya in 2015. Mobius continues to provide end-to-end -end customer support and has applied early product feedback into the development of the next generation Mobius 2, launched in 2019. Mobius vehicles are designed in Africa, for Africa. From product concept to aftercare, a delightful customer experience is central. Mobius has developed vehicles uniquely suited to the demands of the Kenyan consumer. The new Mobius 2 has been ruggedized for challenging rural road terrain and simplified to reduce unnecessary cost and weight. Mobius is a design-driven company and their values underpin all products. The vision of Mobius is to weave built-for-purpose vehicles into the fabric of the growing African economy and become the mass-market car of Africa. 5. Laraki Moroccan businessman, Mohamed Laraki founded Laraki Motors in 1999. The company started by manufacturing yacht, and subsequently moved to produce luxurious supercars. In 2002, it produced the first car, Laraki Fulgura. The next car was Borak, followed by Epitome, and the company has continued to grow and evolve from then. Its 2013 Laraki Epitome concept is sold for $2 million. It has a V8 engine, 1,100 horsepower RPM, and a top speed that is estimated at 175 miles per hour. Larakis are strictly concept cars, custom built for each customer, and were ranked among the most expensive cars in the world in 2015, priced at over $2 million each. 4. Kira Motors Corporation, Uganda Kira Motors Corporation is a state enterprise, established to champion value addition in the nascent motor vehicle industry in Uganda, through technology transfer, contract manufacturing, and supply chain localization. This strategic intervention is poised to contribute to the industrialization agenda envisaged to aid the transformation of Uganda into an upper middle income economy by 2040. Kira Motors Corporation is developing long-term technology partnerships to build core capabilities to develop, make, and sell motor vehicles and components in Africa on a mission to build a better Uganda through automotive technology. The interest of Kira Motors Corporation is different from the other automobile companies in Africa. The Ugandan automotive company is interested in creating a hybrid electronic vehicle. 
It was launched in 2014 by the engineering students of the University of Macarair, who participated in the Vehicle Design Summit launched by MIT students in 2006. The company is supported by the government of Uganda. In its line of cars, KMC has Kyola Solar Bus, Kira Ev Smack, and Kira Ev Pak which has a battery bank capacity of 40 on 207 volts. The type of cars produced by Kira may be an indication of a new dawn for Uganda's automotive industry. Three, Kantanka Cars, Ghana. Kantanka Automobile, a Ghana-based automotive company that designs, manufactures, assembles, and sells luxury cars, was established in 1994 by entrepreneur and preacher Dr. Kwadwosafo Kantanka, and incorporated as a limited liability into the manufacturing of automotive components and their combination with other parts outsourced from component suppliers to form a complete built unit. Kantanka produces both saloon and four-wheel drives. The company also has SUVs. Some Ghanaians and other Africans are already driving some of this made in Ghana cars. The vehicles are on sale at the Kantanka showrooms. The company also started producing electric cars by the end of 2020. Two, Innocent Motors, Nigeria. The first made in Africa automobile brand which launched in 1978, with the purpose of eradicating foreign used automobiles from Africa, and becoming the pride of African roads by making durable and affordable brand new automobiles for Africans. The Innocent Vehicle Manufacturing Company was founded by Nigerian-born entrepreneur, Innocent Chukwuma. They are the first technology company to manufacture cars in Nigeria. Innocent has produced at least 500 Nigeria-made cars at very affordable prices. Due to its wide-range production, Innocent attracts patronage also from the Nigerian government. From their plant in Newi, Anambra, Nigeria's Innocent assembles various vehicles, some of which are pickup vans, SUVs, and buses. 1. Birkin Cars, South Africa Birkin Cars, Limited is a South African-based car manufacturer. Birkin Cars was formed in 1982. The company's specialty and only currently manufactured vehicle is the S3 Roadster, a kit car copy of the Lotus Super 7. The founder and owner of the company is John Watson, a descendant of pioneering race car driver Tim Birkin. John Watson, an automotive enthusiast, was a fan of the classic Lotus 7. However, the car had since ended production from the manufacturer and could no longer be bought as new. The car is sold in various parts of the world including the United States, Japan, and across Europe. Birkin Cars is known for quality classic reproductions, including the SS3 Street Series and the CS3 Clubman Series. 3. Give us the video a like if you enjoyed it. Don't forget to check out some of our recommended videos.